Hello guys, and welcome back to another video with me, SuperFudge27. Today we are playing Terraria. Now, it's been a while since I did a Terraria video. I think it's been at least two weeks now. I'm not actually too sure. But yeah, I've missed playing Terraria. Um, I did go through a stage where I started to get bored because people were just constantly asking me for items going on at all out as well. So I almost quit the series, but I wouldn't do that because I love Terraria at the end of the day. Uh, I know that I'm going to... I, like, should have known... That I was going to get a lot of people asking me. And I did kind of know that I was going to get a lot of people hassling me about it. Uh, but it's fine. I don't care if people are hassling me. But I'm not going to stop the series just for that reason. Because that would be a little bit daft. Now what I want to do today. Uh, is I actually want to make um, a spawn. But I don't know if we can actually. I don't think we can make any spawns. So what I was going to do is I'm going to make a spawn for the destroyer and go up against the destroyer. But then I just realised, actually, guys, if you did watch the last episode, uh, and actually, if we've got we have got this equipped, okay, so that means we will light up. Uh, yeah, I just want to make sure you can hear me. If you did see the last episode, uh, you'll know that we started to build like a boss arena, which is a bit like the one that Snampy Longnose has just recently built. I'm not going to just like imagine he doesn't exist because he does. Like some YouTubers pretend that other YouTubers don't exist, so they don't mention them or something. I don't know why, but you know. Yeah, so we started building that, but ours is going to be slightly bigger. Uh, reason why uh, is because we kind of want a bit of, like, run around. You don't know. It's like we don't want to be stuck in here. We want to be able to run around uh, or fly around or whatever you want to call it. Uh, yeah, so we just want to do, like, nice little things like uh, this. So, yeah, what we're going to need to do now uh, is, I believe, if I turn down my game volume, as usual, always being spammed by my game volume into my ears. Uh, yes, guys, this video has come out late. I've pretty much recorded it on Sunday and it, the time now is 6 o'clock UK time. I'm supposed to have this video out uh, by 11 in the morning uh, but I don't, I don't, I didn't seem to get it out today. Uh, but anyway, I have a live stream uh, which will be coming out at some point. Either it was being done before this, or that it's up as I'm doing as we speak. Uh, then I don't know. But uh, I am pretty much just doing a live stream tonight where I'm going to be hosting the All Items World, so you guys can definitely get in on that. Uh, I didn't do drop off Sunday today. I've been having a really hectic weekend recently, uh, or not hectic like things that I've had to do in real life. Uh, but something I've been doing very secretive uh, that I don't want you guys to know about yet until we hit 1,000 subscribers. Now, it is not the uh, Roxio game recorder. It's definitely not that. It's actually something a lot more awesome. And it's something that I think you guys who are Minecrafters might like. Now, that's all I'm going to say. I won't say too much more. But if you're a Minecrafter, you're going to like this. So that's all I'm saying. But anyway, so if we want to do this, what we want to do... Uh, is we just want to start placing uh, platforms along here. Now what I, is, I haven't done any commentary for so long that I my tonsils and stuff and my whole body, like, within my personality and everything, it's just kind of like laid back and a bit tired. So I need to get back to the place where I was last time when I was making videos to remember how I make a video, if that makes any sense. So yeah, I know how to press the record button. It's just like when you've been away for a little while, uh, sometimes your style goes away with it. Like, I don't know, a lot of people say to me, well, your style should never go away because that's you, but sometimes things do happen, and that is what that's just one of those things for me, unfortunately. Uh, but yeah, so if you're wondering why I'm leaving the little gaps on the side, it's because of the same reason uh, as Stampy did it for, but it's so that I can genuinely just get around uh, without dying, so like I can fly really fast. But then again, I know that my wings are quite more advanced than what his ones are, uh, but then again, you know that that doesn't really matter, because uh, yeah, it doesn't mean we can't have nice things too. Uh, so yeah, so yeah, anyway, what are we going to do? Right, we need to go back and get some wood. Actually, no, we don't even have to go back to get the wood. Uh, we can just get it ourselves because we have a chainsaw. If you remember, I made this chainsaw a long time ago now, I think, actually. I don't know when I made it, but it must have been a while ago. It must have been a while ago, a while ago actually. Oh, actually, guys, I'm going to be adding someone to uh, the signs. Now, if you didn't see in the last episode, um, just before the end, I did a thing that Luke Games... Funny enough, I didn't know that Luke Games is doing this until like I told him that I started to do it and he invited me to his world, uh, which he does his Let's Plays on, uh, and he showed me it. Now, pretty much, I started working on this down here, uh, and this is going to be like a sign shout-out garden. So yeah, John Kreese uh, recently got a shout-out in this. Uh, so who I'm going to add today uh, is actually someone that you're going to know. Uh, it's going to be Luke 
games. So I'm going to add loot games to my uh, shout out wall uh, or whatever and loot games is going to be here for a long time now. Uh, so yeah, forever. Um, but if any of you guys uh, want to get into this, all you have to do is leave your name down in the description below or the description then I think you'd be hacking. So please make sure you put it in the comments below. Uh, yeah, so if you do that, then um, I will definitely add you to that. Uh, but anyway, so we got pearl wood. I just realized that's a completely different type of wood, which I don't really want it to be different colors. Maybe we could have finished off this normal wood uh, colors like oak. I'm guessing this is like oak. I'm going to say oak wood. I know it don't it don't have description oak wood, but it kind of, it just, you know, it looks like wood. It looks like oak wood. So, you know, anyway, so I guess what we could do uh, so we can make a load of wood platforms and then we just finish off this row and then we could use up all the pearl wood. But then again, I don't know. We could be pretty good for just normal wood here. Uh, actually, let's get the uh, imbusing station or something like that. I don't know what it's actually called. It's quite crazy. Um, so, yeah, if any of you got anything you want me to do, whether if there's an item in the game you want me to try and get or build, give me ideas, suggestions. I am really open for them because I'm starting to get kind of uh, lost for things to do in the game. Uh, like, this is literally all I've got. I think I can go up against all the bosses and then I pretty much don't actually see what po what the point is in me playing the game anymore. But if you've got any idea, like, you want me to get a certain item and build it legit or do something to get it legit, then... Please do tell me, because I would love that. Like, if you've got any suggestions on bosses to fight, um, or on a weapon you want me to find, or something you want me to do, then I'll, I'll definitely do it, as long as it's not stupid, and it's quite a reasonable idea. <laughs> like, I don't want it to be like, um, let's think about this. Um, here's a suggestion you might want to give me. Go down and summon the war flesh and then kill yourself. That sort of thing. I'm not going to do that. But if you give me something good like go down, see how fast you can kill the war flesh. Or see how fast you can kill the destroyer. Um, or go and see if you can find a beam sword. Or if you can find something really cool made of blade, uh, blade of grass. Something. I've already got one of those. I will probably won't bother making that again. But yeah. Uh, so yeah. But we have like last time we uh, went for like a little journey to get the terror blade. Uh, which we did end up getting in the end guys. Which was absolutely awesome. Because uh, we went up against about, I think it was two or three. I think it was three actually. Actually, free um, solar eclipse just to get that so yeah we were very lucky I think if you asked me to have gotten it at all right so once you've done that uh, we want to go one more here and then once we've done that I know it's pretty much just me placing down platforms in this episode I'm sorry about that guys uh, but I just thought that you know we're, we're doing good progress right now that, that's that's the main thing we're doing good progress so who is it we get souls of light from I think souls of light come from uh, isn't that in the hallow biome? I think that's in the hallow. So yeah, we're in the hallow right now. So that's actually quite a good thing. So what we can do uh, is in a minute we can dig down and see if we can go into a cave and find ourselves uh, some souls of light because that's what we're going to need for the destroy spawn. And then in the next video, uh, we should be able to go up against destroy. But I'm just going to go check because uh, I did make a destroyer spawn before, but I was using complete wrong things. Uh, apparently Nimbus Rod is quite strong as I was watching the... Stampy as he was doing it and it was very surprising uh, that he defeated him because I didn't think he was going to and I thought he was going to die a ton of times but uh, no I, I was really surprised but uh, that's where he's better than me uh, for that one so anyway um, let's have a little look what am I looking for I'm looking for a spawn so I'm looking in a completely different area what's this do oh yeah also if you want me to build any certain equipables as well uh, just give suggestions please do uh, increase increases uh, your max number of minions increases the damage and knockback of your minions so I don't know what that does does that allow you to have two pets at once that's cool, I think, if that is what I think it is. A charm of myths, whatever that is. Magic cuffs, a rope coil, a master ninja gear. What's that? Okay. These are cool. Moon shell, Neptune shell. Okay. Right, anyway, let's have a look at this. So, actually, I think we could already have enough of these. But, we wouldn't, we, wait, we wouldn't even have to go to a demon altar. So, we, we might actually have some souls of night. We might have souls of night already. Do we not have Souls of Night? I was so sure we had Souls of Night. I don't actually know if we would be able to get any Souls of Night in this uh, world anymore because I kind of cleaned it up a long time ago. Uh, when I first rebooted it and converted over to Xbox One, uh, I had to rebuild my house and I kind of decided to take out the uh, biome corruption without even knowing how valuable it was going to be. Uh, and yes, yeah, so that's where I made a stupid mistake. Um... 
Yeah, so, so hang on a minute. So I don't know if we actually do have a corruption, but just let me have a little look and I'll tell you. Uh, we do have a corruption here, actually, though, uh, which is something uh, we can take advantage of. Uh, where is that? That's actually quite a big advantage. Oh, what the heck? I never realised that. No, the world's got to be corrupted. It's got to be, like, sp spreading. Hey, iPad, please be quiet. I think it's actually spreaded a load of my world. So if you remember, like, in the last episode, uh, I was t telling you about the steampunk and how I wanted to move in so that we can, like, get the uh, kilometer or something like that. I don't know what it's called. Uh, but, yeah, so it's basically like a gun, uh, but it shoots out purification powder and it purifies the world. Uh, now, basically, uh, that whole hole... Um, I don't think that's going to be quiet, so I'm going to do that myself. Alright, so I just be quiet. I just made that. I'm sorry about that noise, guys. Uh, yeah, so basically, um, if you remember in the last episode I told you about that, uh, I don't think this is actually such a bad thing now. So I might not clean it up completely. I might try and stop it from spreading. Uh, but I don't know if I will, like, completely break it. Let's have a look, then. Let's just go down far in, have a look at what we can find, and then, yeah, hopefully I didn't purify it, and it's just not updated on the map or something. I don't know if that happens, but maybe could have done. Um, so, yeah, let's, let's have a little look. Let's be really careful uh, down here, because it is very dangerous um, at times. I know that. Let's have a little look. There's nothing here, though. It's just or calcum stone see the fact that there's loads of stone kind of scares me because it makes me think that yeah i did come here back when i started to reboot the world so you know i think it might be possible that there is no corruption here because uh, we should oh wait no 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 the corruption is more this side okay that's quite weird i didn't even realize I didn't even realise that it's this side. Okay, let's, let's keep having a look. If we can find it, that would be amazing, guys. Uh, we went pretty fast then. Uh, this titanium. Like, what can we even use titanium for anyway? I don't think it's, like, important to us anymore. I don't think we can actually do anything with it, but uh, we might as well get it because we can. Oh, ah, what's down there? There's, like, a chest. I wonder if there's anything in it. I mean, I know that we pretty much got a load of good stuff. And actually, we just found two gold coins. I'll take that. And we took... Gerald! This is where Gerald's been all that time that we couldn't find Gerald. It's because he was here. It was here. He was in the, in this little cave. Right, let's have a look. So, um, oh, look, there's some coins there. Don't mind if I do. Right, um, let's watch out because I think that now we are actually in the corruption. So, this means that we could get taken out at any moment, and I don't really want that because <laughs> we are pretty powerless. Look at this, see? No, oh, wait, when I say powerless, I just meant I feel powerless. But I guess I'm not actually, though, because it's been a while since I've been to the Corruption. Uh, I haven't really been to the Corruption since I started the series reboot. So, yeah. But I guess I say I feel overpowered or something now, but, you know, I wouldn't say that too soon because then I'd get taken out. Actually, if I go down there, it's going to become the Hallow, which I don't really want. I want to stay in the Corruption, so I'm going to go back up here and I'm going to dig into the side of this. So in a minute... Uh, I will be, well, maybe when this video comes out, I would have been streaming for an hour and a half. Uh, so, yeah, it's going to be insane, guys. Insane. Right, so this is episode 64 or 65. I'm not really too sure myself, but, uh, yeah, this just kill you. Let's have a look in here. Uh, an Aya Cthulhu spore might say no to it. Um, let's get rid of the cobwebs and let's have a look in here. This is a band of regeneration, yes. Um, let's get rid of, I think we get rid of that. Ow, oh, ow, a spectre elemental. What do you do? Uh, oh, you drop both. That's cool. So does any enemy drop, not have a chance of dropping um, souls of night in, in this when you're in the corruption? What is that? There's like a cursed flame, I think. Um, cursed flame. Not even water can put the flame out. Okay, I don't know what that is. Um, twenty percent increased arrow speed and damage. That is definitely going to be taken by me. And that is for silk blocks. I don't really think we need silk blocks anymore, so they're not even important. So let's just carry on and have a look. That's actually really cool. So we're actually not doing too bad now, guys. We've actually come down here. We've gotten what we want to get. Or we've gotten something, or what we wanted, or what we targeted to go and get. We got something of it, but we haven't got every one of them. Remember, we still need about three, I believe. Let's have a look. Uh, so, no, no, we only need two. We only need two, I think. And then we can make a destroyer one. And then in the next video, uh, we can go up against the destroyer. Ah, wait, the Corruptor. They've got to definitely drop them, surely, haven't they? 
They've got they've got to have big chances of dropping them, surely. No? Do a corruption not have a good chance of dropping them? Cursed flames. I think you get those from the daggers or whatever he was called. Uh, so let's have a look. Um, you didn't draw. <gasps> the bound goblin. Yes, we got a goblin tinkerer finally. Yes. Right. Let's have a look. Before you get killed, my friend, I am buying one of these from you. And I'm not saying you're going to get killed. I'm just hoping you don't. But you know, you might get killed. And I'm going to take some rocket boots just because I can. That's the only reason why I'm doing it. Do you know, you're amazing, my friends. You are amazing. Make sure you move into housing ASAP. And I think there is a place for housing, so please do. Right, let's have a little look. There's nothing in there. Wait, look, Souls of Light. Someone killed themselves in lava. That is absolutely awesome. All right, so guys, we pretty much got what we wanted to do. Now, all I want to do now uh, is go back to the start. But the problem is I have to go all the way back up again. I'm lazy when it comes to this game and trying to go back up because we'll be here all day. Right, okay, so let's dig up. Um, right, let's keep digging. Let's keep digging. It's, it's like finding Nemo. Let's keep, um, let's keep swimming. Let's keep swimming. I just had to think then. <laughs> I've waited 10 years for finding Dory and they still haven't released it. Oh my goodness. Is that actually a thing? Are they actually going to make Finding Dory? Because I, I was never like around to find out if that was a joke or if that was real. Um, oh look, let's take this and we should be able to get an arms dealer to move in because then we'd have something that he's interested in. So let's have a little look. Worm teeth, no. Let's get rid of mud because uh, nobody really needs mud. Uh, there's nothing here. Right, okay, let's not get distracted because what I want to do now is get out so that I can actually go and make the spawn and in the next video get ready to go up against the destroyer. And actually... Oh, I don't know what we want to do, whether if in the next video we want to go up against... Alright, you guys are going to decide it tonight or tomorrow, whenever. Uh, you're going to decide, and I'm going to read next week's comments, uh, whether if I go up against the Destroyer this, uh, next week, or whether if I... What I do next is I get loads of campfires, and I just put them in a line, uh, and then I upgrade it, and then maybe go up against the Destroyer if we still have time, uh, if you get what I mean. So I get loads of campfires, put them all along the platforms, and that would help regen my health really well. But but that's completely up to you. I hope it doesn't give him health, actually, when I attack him. Because, uh, yeah, but I don't think it does. I think it literally only just gives it to players. So, uh, yeah, we should be okay. Uh, re relatively fine. Right, let's try and get out of here because otherwise I'm going to be stuck in here for a long time, which I'm not exactly going to like, my friends. Not exactly. And I think if we fly up here, maybe? I don't know. Uh, it looks like somewhere where I've been before. So maybe we do have a corruption, guys. Just an underground corruption now. Uh, which I never knew uh, that we had uh, until literally today. <laughs> today is the first time I've actually seen it. So, yeah, it's been amazing. All right, so now let's have a little look on the map uh, where we are. So uh, we are pretty much where we want to be going. So if we go in this direction, uh, when I get home, I'll make the thingy. And then I think we're in the episode. And yeah, and then, yeah. So, and also, if you want to be in featured in the sign, then make sure you put your name down in the description. And I will try and add you. Oh, well, I will add you. Uh, but I will pick you randomly. So if you don't get in next week, uh, do continue to try. And the Goblin Tinkerer just got slain. Well, do you know what? It doesn't matter. At least we got the... Oh, wait. We already got Tinkerer's Workshop. Well, I don't remember getting that. Oh, well, at least we got one. I, in my eyes, is probably a bit more legit because I don't think we got the other one legit. I think that one might have been one that... Remember X-Ray used to be in the series? I think he might have brought in. So, yeah, at least we've kind of done this legit now, okay? Uh, but that's a shame. The, um... Tinker has just been killed. Oh, well, it doesn't really matter. Hopefully, I'll get him in uh, next time. And also, I'm going to take for myself a magic mirror in future. Uh, and what I'm going to do uh, is Souls of Night. I don't think I picked up the Souls of Night. Oh, goodness. Guys, I don't think I have picked it up. I don't think I picked it up. I've got the four of them, but that's not enough. We need five. Oh, it doesn't really matter anyway, guys, because in the next video, uh, what I'll do is, before I do the next video, I'll go and get the next uh, Soul of Night that we're going to need. Uh, but anyway, guys, all you have to decide now in the description is put your names out and you can be featured on next week's signs. If you're not, don't worry, you can always have next week to put them in. Um, also, guys, you get the decision on whether if next episode I'm just going to spend a load of time getting campfires and then putting them all along the platform. Uh, and then if we have time at the end of it, maybe go up against the Destroyer. But if we don't, don't have time, uh, then we'll 
go up against them the week after that. Uh, but anyway, guys, you can choose whether if it's a destroyer or the campfires that we'll be doing next week. So it's up to you. Get voting now in the comments. I will listen. Anyway, guys, I'm in Super First Jewel 7. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, I'm happy to be back doing Terraria videos. I hope you're happy that I'm back to be watching my videos. Uh, but anyway, guys, I hope you've enjoyed. I will see you guys all later. I'm in Super First Jewel 7. And peace. Goodbye, guys.